Hey guys, Sexdude26 here, and welcome back to Let's Play Rayman Advance. In the previous part, we got all the cages in the second world, and now we're heading to the third world to get the cages there, Blue Mountains. And with me today, I have a hitting the wrong button because I'm a goose. Uh, I mean, I have a special guest with me. Introduce yourself, my friend. Hello, people. I am CKC Boy 100, but you can name me Ben because that's what pretty people normally call me. So yes, I am a special guest of this today's venue. Quite. And yes. Quite indeed, yes. Yeah. <laughs> I've been meaning to get Ben in a recording for ages, so... Yes, good to finally have you on, sir. Ah, it's not a problem. Just my hair rides play them now and again, so I can't do this stuff. And I missed a cage, whoops. Ah, it's not bad, you can always get back down. Hmm. Running makes it much quicker, too. I always hated this, this uh, level because I always hated the rocks and all that. They always mm. killed me when they explode. And they're just, you know, spawning out of absolute nothingness. How is this working? I don't know. It's old logic from an old society. Old logic from uh, an old society in France. Why France? <laughs> <laughs> Wait, was it France that made this? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> Love the creative minds of the French. Ah, mais oui, we are a bit crazy on the weed. <laughs> Not exactly sure why weed would make this <laughs> game would be more crazy, but... <laughs> uh, <laughs> oh, the analogy works fairly well. Uh, uh... Alrighty then. Four cages. I'm just blazing through. Yeah. <laughs> I've been scaring myself hey. how quickly I've been going. It's nuts. Are you sure you haven't even practiced this whole game before you played this? Um, uh, practice for a while. A couple trips on the train were a good opportunity to practice. <laughs> to and from uni, but other than that. Ah, uh, yes. Hmm. <laughs> I think my favourite land of all would be Music Land, just because I just love the whole mechanics behind it. Mm. That and in the PS1 hey. theme. The boss theme for Mr. Sax. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I love that. Best boss theme ever. <laughs> no, we go three and a half minutes and one level yeah. done. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> I'm going way yeah, too fast. Quick. Way too fast, way too quick. Is it wrong of me to actually be hearing all the sound effects in my head when I'm when I'm watching you do this? No, no, that, that's perfectly reasonable. <laughs> Sometimes, you know, I'll be recording stuff with friends, and I'll just be going. I can't hear any of the audio, so I'm just gonna have the soundtrack playing in the background while I watch. I don't need to do that. I remember this soundtrack. <laughs> I've played it so many times when I was mm. when it, back in the bit, old days. Wow, I sound old. <coughs> Big stacky balls. Pendulums of doom! And death and destruction and ouch. And ouchiness. <laughs> oh, you got a bit ouch. of a boo boo there. <laughs> what? That was done. What? What? Ah. I have no idea what you're trying to do. <laughs> yeah, I think that made a cage a pit. Yeah. Oh, uh, yeah, we're getting into the sneaky cage hiding. Do this, that, and the other thing, then walk around seven times in a circle, do a backflip, knock yourself on the head, and then boom, there's a cage. Do that six times. <laughs> Crazy of nonsense. Of course, of course. I do that all the time. You know, that's what I do every time. Well, they pretty much spell it out. It's. It's clear as that no, no, it really, it really isn't. This is something I've kind of been a bit confused about. Like, um, I can't remember because I, I was never, I never really, I don't think I ever completed Rayman on the PS1 version. Mm. But I can't remember this entirely. Maybe you would. But to unlock the la the, the map, the boss, you have to get all the fairies. Is that correct? Yeah, you got to get all of the cages just to get to the last level. Yeah. Mm. And that's the main reason why a lot of people I know who played this game never finished it. 
Mm. I can get to the last level, just never. I could. It, it's just so hard to find the cages. Hmm. I remember the first time I played it. I just looked up a cheat, used the password, final boss, yes. <laughs> That's what I basically did, so it was just that I cheated for all the, all the levels and then I just played for a laugh. Hmm. Pretty much- Ah! Evil big spike things. Ooh, snick. A snick, a snick. I think there are, you're underestimating your sneakiness right there. Yes, I think I am. <laughs> hey, it's Rockapella. <laughs> Uh, that amused me for a second. <laughs> <laughs> Even if no I'm sure it amuses the view. I sh I'm sure it will amuse <laughs> the viewers too. Ah uh, well. Did they say they were making a new Rayman game anytime recently? I I'm not entirely sure about that one. Yeah, well, um, Rayman Origins came out last year, and they're currently working on one for the Wii U. Granted, it's only for the Wii U, and that kind of disappoints me, because that means me, you know, PC, PS2, no, can't play it, nope. It's, yeah, it's kind of unfair, but... I mean, we have, I have, like, my brother's played Rayman Origins, it's just, you know, it doesn't, it's not... They say it's supposed to be the Origins of Rayman, but really doesn't, it seems like a different type of Rayman yeah. entirely. So I'm not the really idea a fan was that was it. that was what the game was going to be about, and then that ended up being the theme of the trailer, and then that that was all of the backtracking backstory that we got. <laughs> so anything origin related was in the trailer, and everything else is a completely different adventure. It was like I don't know. I was like, hang on, Raymond's making weird noises and weird faces that he would never normally does. Like, how is and he's wearing origin? a hoodie instead of having a scarf. What is this? I don't know, it's like, I don't know. I think yeah. they're trying to just aim it for, I, I really think they're just trying to aim it for modern audiences, not for the people that used to play it. Hmm. Though, though the game is just packed to the brim with nostalgia, so you just, just do some levels and you just... It's go, fun, it's fun. I remember that, I remember that, I remember that, oh my goodness, this game is amazing. <laughs> it's not as good as what I expected it, but it's not bad in its big hmm. zone. Holy shit, yeah, 44 lives, I just noticed that. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I keep looking at my live count and I'm just going, hang on, I have a lot of lives? And I just think back to my first playthrough of the game on the PS1 and I'm just going, if I remember correctly, I'm stuck in the fourth world and I've only got three lives and no continues. How do I yeah, have 44 lives again? <laughs> I'm exactly like that. How the fuck? I mean, uh, are you really this good? <laughs> Maybe I practiced too much. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe. Ah, oh, uh, no. Nah, running into stuff. Maybe not. Well, you've been running carefree into like spikes and all that. So I don't think you can. It's it's a mature it's a mixture of speed running and going for everything. I'm just sort of. trying to think of, um, have you collected all the power-ups yet? Um, no, I don't think you have. Yeah, I got all the power-ups. Ah, oh, okay. I was just trying to remember, because you are like, halfway, or, or, or something like that, and, uh, I, I wasn't sure if you got all the power-ups or not. Hmm. I made sure I got all the power-ups before I started going for the cages. Makes life a little bit easier. Yeah, because you... Some of them you can only get with the power-ups. Hmm. Granted, I have been known to, and I think I've said this at least three times in recordings now, completely break the second level and get five cages at the start of the game. <laughs> well, at the start of the game, it just, it's very easy to get some of them, yeah, but not all of them. Uh-oh, uh-oh. 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 God, sir, that, oh, I've actually had that one before. Uh, uh, uh. So the rate you're going, uh, you seem to be you should be able to do this quite quickly. Mm. <laughs> Granted, like the it. next level's got at least four different sections in it, but I think I can remember where all the cages are, so it shouldn't take. Well, <laughs> spike. 
eyes. Ouch. <laughs> That's a cut. It's spiky the eyes, but the eyes are spikes. Ouch. <laughs> Now that you think of it, how does Spike have eyes? Hmm. How does Rayman exist with no limbs? <laughs> how does Again, he Ubisoft logic. <laughs> okay. Oh, yeah. He's like a hipster, that's what he is. Yo, yo. <laughs> <laughs> Three times in a row, but <laughs> in, in theory, it's possible you should know what's going wrong. <laughs> I have no words for that. <laughs> I just, I just, I just. I, I'm just gonna let go of the run button. Let's see if that possibly. Maybe you know the... what? I know you're doing a recording, but you don't have to move at 20 miles per hour. You can take your time. <laughs> Deep breath in. Deep breath uh, out. Panic, yeah. panic, 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 panic. <laughs> hey, 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 take a deep breath in. Take a deep breath in and imagine yourself as a balloon. A nice soft balloon that's about to get squashed into a million pieces. Does that help at all? <laughs> and possibly set on fire. Yeah, it was so really so hard. Apparently so, because it took five tries. Ah, you were a balloon. I am now. I am one with the balooniness. <laughs> and now to continue my calm state of being balloon. This is actually working really well. That's because you're panicking. I should be a balloon more often. Worst thing about doing recordings, when you talk, your mind is elsewhere, so your skills drop dramatically. Mm. No matter. How many people you tell, even in the comment section, they always say, Oh, you suck at this, I could do a better job. <laughs> well, if I wasn't talking, I could do more concentration. <laughs> Pretty much, yeah. Uh, there is stuff. Yeah, there is stuff. Okay. There is stuff. Yes, there is much stuff. All of the stuff. All of the stuff shall be yours. What do you McDonald's? I know it's very somewhere, but do you have a McDonald's from where you are? Yeah, we, we do have McDonald's, believe it or not. <laughs> uh, it, I know, it's just a random thing, isn't it? I have these conversations with people all the time. They go, do you have this in Australia? Do you have this in Australia? Do you have this, <laughs> this, this? I mean, I knew you most likely did. Hmm. Just... No, we do. There, there are a lot of things I get asked about that we don't have, or I ask about a lot of things and people don't have them, and I'm just going, how do you not have that? Oh, there's only one store of it. That's probably why. Like what, as an example? Uh, well, well, come to think of it, the only place I can think of is the pizza place I go to, but that's beside the point. Um, oh, those type of stores, yeah, they're like homemade, like people just make one random restaurant, so I suppose. Unless it's a chain restaurant. <laughs> hmm. I could do with a pizza right now. Fuck you, man. Fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Am I allowed to swear in these, or is it friend, or is it uh, user friendly? <laughs> Either way, you can beep it out. <laughs> <laughs> I tried doing that once, yeah, but I kind of lost. One patient. second interruption. Yes. <laughs> Hooray for not taking out the rubbish! Hurrah! That, that is the weirdest thing to come back from a video cut to. But, possibly the most awesome. Um, I've gone the wrong way. I meant to go up there. And not run headfirst into spikes like a dingle puss. A what? <laughs> Oh, what's a dingle I think I'm just making up words now. Or uh, not, not possibly. Well, I see. I think, so dingle, do... I think dingle Puss is actually an Abbott Costello joke, but never mind. Well, I do say you do flabbergast the little um, uh, pun, the pun, pun tree. 
You flabbergasting me. And that's me trying to think of a word to actually say. <laughs> <laughs> I'll try to say, make a word of the spot. Or my cover is pun pun tree. What's a pun tree? <laughs> Add it to the dictionary now. Quick, creative, inventive, completely random meaning. Go. <laughs> Oh god, I can't remember what that website, random words, you can find weird meanings for words. Wait! So you basically, did you at, at all have to look up a guide for where to look for these, or did you just, or did you just know them off the heart? Uh, countless, countless, countless weeks of trying to find them to actually have a legitimate save file. <laughs> And then after that, I kind of practice to remember where they are. I mean, the first three worlds, I'm pretty good at finding them. Oh yeah, the first three worlds. Third world's a bit iffy, but you get to the fourth world, and I completely forget where all of them are. Hey, this good old Tim Bob Jones. Oh, I love these. Oh, mate, somebody's calling me. I think it's lunchtime. I'll be right back. Continue playing. I'll just get my lunch. Okie doke. Shouldn't be much of a problem. I don't still gonna win! <laughs> <laughs> on that note, Whee! Alrighty. Okay. Well... Where are the cages? Um... It's no food like show business! Now that I messed that up. <laughs> <laughs> I actually started There's my stuff in the room just now. I was like, hello, ladies and gentlemen, I'm here. <laughs> that, that spikes? Uh, I always do that. I sometimes enter my room jumping through like I'm James Bond. Other times I, I act like I'm a woman. Don't comment on me on that. I, I random moments. <laughs> <laughs> it makes life a bit more interesting. Except for when the neighbor <laughs> at, when the neighbor's looking up at your window and then you just duck by your embarrassment. <laughs> Do I know all about drawing attention to myself? I play the saxophone. <laughs> Explains your name. <laughs> In public, at a bus stop, near a train station, at full volume. Were you trying to, were you bought busking for money or something, or? Practicing. <laughs> a friend had just bought a soprano saxophone, he's just going, you want to play it? And I'm just squonking away on it. Yeah, you're pretty good then. All of the squonking. <laughs> oh well. Ah. Oh, I got what was down here. Hmm. Exactly, like, what's the cause of you flying anyway? I can't remember what is it, some sort of potion? Yep. Or if we go by a flash animation I found, the, the, the hippie mu uh, musician actually gives you a wee. <laughs> Someone made a flash, because the, the magician has a couple of voice clips in the PC version, and he sounds like he is completely stoned. <laughs> Not sure if it was intentional, it was like, Man, I'm like, man, I'm like bonding with the trees and Mother Nature, man. I'm so, like, high right now. That explains a lot. <laughs> now my uh, reference to French weed is coming here right now. <laughs> <laughs> it all comes full circle. Some people, sometimes you see a game and you say, oh, what were they smoking? Well, this level, ooh, I kind of a pain, this one. And this, this always stumped me for the longest time. How come? I, I always miss this, because the cage is pretty much off-screen from the whole flood water flying down slowly section, so you just think, yeah, there's nothing up there. But of course, since it's a helicopter section, exploration is sort of encouraged, and they decide, oh, we'll put a cage up there. They'll find it. I didn't the first time. Completely. Well, it makes it a bit makes a noise easy to find. 
true. Yeah, that. I don't know why, but I'm hearing that song, We Love to Boogie, while watching him jump around. I don't know why. We love to boogie. Now I can't get boogie, and now I've got boogie wonderland stuck in my head. That is weird. How the hell did you get that from what? Oh, I suppose I can't understand. <laughs> Now I'm getting that play that funky music, white boy. What the hell's going on? <laughs> play that funky music, white boy. <laughs> oh, awesome. <laughs> I have no clue what's going on in my brain anymore. Actually, I stopped asking that ages ago. <laughs> Likewise. <laughs> From my brain, respectively. Most of the stuff is a question mark in my head. <laughs> Okay, he actually didn't run off the cliff this time. What, you mean you did it or you did? <laughs> I knocked him and then he, wa he kind of practically moonwalked off the cliff. <laughs> exactly. Uh, uh, whoa. For the longest time, whenever I was a kid, I've always wanted to be able to swing like him, like just be able to throw some sort of fist in the air and just like swing or stuff. Hmm. You know, for a second there, I didn't know whether you were talking about Rayman or Michael Jackson. <laughs> yes, Michael I'm just going, but he can't throw his fists. Oh, well, he can dance. Uh, but yes, but what does that have to do with throwing fists? I completely missed everything that was said. <laughs> yes, Michael Jackson, his dance moves, he just punches his fist in the air and he goes swinging across the room. He's that magical. The way you make me feel. Nunchuck. Nunchuck. <laughs> <laughs> Kung Fu <laughs> Elvis. <laughs> no, Kung Fu Elvis? No, Kung Fu Michael Jackson. Now I've got Kung Fu Elvis doing Michael Jackson dance moves in my head with no limbs. What on earth is wrong with my head? That's what happens when you hang out with me. This is what my brain just normally goes through every day. Yeah. And it's awesome. <laughs> Confusing it is the most easiest thing in the world. <laughs> How long did he, I don't know, um... I bet a bit 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 a I hate it. Sometimes you get lost in a linear level. Like, I just don't know how people get lost in a linear level. I have a feeling I've missed one. It's not good. But did I miss it? Complete the level and find out. I shall have to. And then I'm going to backtrack through this again. Um... Just do it off camera, really. <laughs> That's the best thing. I just like, alright, be back in a second. And then magically, by the power of YouTube, you find it. <laughs> That's the best thing. Windows Movie Maker, you've done it again. <laughs> where? I think it's a... No! I know. I know where it is. I know where it is. I think. Do I? Maybe. Don't know. I don't know anymore. Maybe I might want to call an Indian service television provider. They might be able to provide you some help in the Department of Funding stuff. Well, there's one of them. Uh, but is that... The one. Is it the one? Is that the one? For you is him the one? No. Ah, the only one. A pepperoni pizza. But I still feel like I'm missing one. But <laughs> ambush. What? Right. Yeah, I really feel like I'm missing one. Stop thinking and start doing. This is the military. <laughs> not, anyway. <coughs> You're about to die if you stop focus if you don't focus. <laughs> okay, maybe this one. Well now I have an excuse to use Yakity Sex in the video, so we'll be right back. <laughs>
bastard thing! There it is. See? It was right down here. Of all places. Where, where, where? I can't see it. There was a teeny weeny what? sparkle right there. Uh, I thought you got it though. Oh, I didn't know that. I saw that and I was like, hang on a minute. Did he yeah. get... I saw that platform and I thought you got it already. Yeah, because... That was genius! <laughs> because well, that spot... Collect... Because that spot has an extra life in the PS1 and PC version, so I thought it had an extra life in the advanced version, and that's why I didn't check down there, because I thought I've got an extra life there, so... That is just hate it when they change it all around for the different consoles and countries, it's not right. No, it's not right, it's just freaking annoying, because then there's just... I want to use a cage guide, but this one's for a different version, so it's completely useless. <laughs> and yes, I am backtracking through the rest of the level. You are not imagining things, because this is actually quicker than doing the rest of the level. I know. <laughs> Makes perfect sense. At first I was like, why are you... Ah... Uh, my brain just flipped, for once. Even though my brain's like a sensible peanut! <laughs> and finally, after a complete Hello. bit of fluff up, that's all of the cages in the first half of the game, essentially. Woo! <sighs> Actually, I might want to save. That might, that might be a really good idea. <laughs> game crashes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So, after that complete and total derp, that's going to be it for this episode of Let's Play Rayman Advance. In the next part... We're going to go into Picture City and a Razor Plane. So until then, this has been SaxDude26. Paparazzi, Everett, for Secrecy Boy 100. See you next time.